Hello YouTube, Freddy Cardona here. We're on our way to do East 22nd Street for our Pride in Patterson feature every street video. And this right here is the very tip, the northern tippy tip of East 22nd Street. For those of you that have been following my channel, you know that I have several playlists on here. Pride in Patterson being one of them Fred Drives being another, Driving and the News, and the Relaxation playlist. So this particular video is part of my Pride in Patterson playlist. A lot of P's, Pride in Patterson playlists. P -p 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 All right, Pride in Patterson playlist featuring every street. In this episode, we're going to feature East 22nd Street. We are driving south on this street, starting here from... Uh, let me just show you real quick, Start, starting from First Avenue there on the corner uh, behind me. It's a beautiful day. Let's get you into the tour. Or not so much of a tour, because I'm not a tour guide. More of a drive-through. And I'm going to try to drive slow, so I'm going to pull over here for a moment. Let this white SUV go first, because they're in a rush. And we have... Waldeck Automotive on the left, Waldeck. C Marino Warehouse, 72nd, 2nd Avenue. I did all of these videos already. 2nd Ave, 3rd Ave, 4th Ave. So we're now on the east numbered streets. If you're from this neighborhood or you lived on East 22nd Street, let us know in the comments below. Unique Beauty Hair Salon there on the left. Crossing 3rd Avenue. Gonna roll down my window, give you some organic Patterson sounds. Sometimes these cars are angry because I'm sticking out too far on the intersection and they wanna stare you down. The problem is the cars that are parked on these other streets are parked so close to the corner that you need to stick out as much as possible to see if any other cars are coming. I'm going to stop here for a moment. Let this truck go past. Let's pick up truck. I don't want to go fast because I want you guys to enjoy the ride with me. If you hear that I'm a little a little sniffly, I'm having allergies. So my voice might sound weird. Crossing the intersection very slowly. You have to proceed with caution. Even if you have the right of way when you're going through an intersection, you never know when the other driver is not paying attention. I'm trying to drive really slow so that you can hear the organic Patterson sound. Sounds like the Magic Garden. Have, have anyone ever watched that show back in the 70s? Hear that? It's quiet and the, and the birds are singing. So anyway, the Magic Garden was a, a kid's show that um, came on on Channel 11 here in the New York metropolitan area. And the two hosts, when they were be, would be speaking, you would hear the birds in the background. That was the reference I was talking about. We 
have high-end electric there on the left-hand side. As we cross 7th Avenue, Just bringing you along with me through your old neighborhoods here in Patterson, New Jersey. If you're not subscribed, the best way to support the channel is to subscribe to the channel, to hit that like button as we cross 8th Avenue. And the reason we always ask you to click the like button is because that helps the YouTube algorithm to push the video to, to, to larger audiences and we can let more people know that this channel exists and that Patterson, New Jersey is not this unlivable place that some people will say it is. So that's the best way to support the channel. As we cross the intersection of 9th Avenue We have some type of factory or warehouse or distribution center. Yep, Providence Logistics, EDM Machine and Tool Company are some of the signs that I noticed. There's another company there on the left. I couldn't see the name of it though. As we come across East uh, 10th Avenue, with school number 21 there on the right side. There are no, there's no school in session today. So there are no students. School 21, ooh, blurry. Oh great, blurry school. Crossroads Ministry Center there on the left. Gilmore Memorial Preschool also in that red brick building. Crossing 11th Avenue. I got my YouTube shirt on so that if I get pulled over, because let's face it, if you see a random car constantly up and down neighborhoods, it would make a few people nervous. And I gotta tell you, I will not get insulted as we cross 12th Ave if I get pulled over. If a police officer notices that I'm circling the neighborhood and pulls me over to check me out, I'm not gonna get upset. I would welcome that. I mean, if I'm, li if I'm in my neighborhood and there's a car driving around my neighborhood, some random guy with a you know recording video, I don't know what they're up to. I mean, there's no crime against that. It's not illegal, but it's a little unsettling if the same car starts circling blocks, right? Especially if there's children around. So if I get pulled over because an officer noticed that I, my, I look suspicious, I'm not going to get upset. That officer is doing his job or her job, his or her job. And that's what they do. They're, they're out here. They're, they're making sure that everyone is safe and they, they think that there's a car that might be up to no good. They want to stop and check it out by all means. I don't know if that's probable cause or you know whatever the legalese is. And I know we have our rights as, as citizens, um, but I, I personally will not mind if I get pulled over circling these neighborhoods as I, as I record my videos. And I tell you what, it'll be a great chance to meet an officer, tell them thank you for your, for your service to the community because there are a lot of good cops out here. 
and this is not an easy job. East 22nd Street. Do you want to go? Go ahead. I'm traveling. I don't like rushing. I want you guys to enjoy these neighborhoods, these streets. El Final Barbershop. Got Lily's Laundromat. Crossing Park Avenue and the tracks. There's a ladies and gents hair salon on the left. And I know what some people will say, and I understand. Some people don't trust cops. Some people don't like cops. I understand. But just keep in mind that for every single group, there's always horrible people in those groups. And I'm not gonna condemn the entire industry for those few that are horrible, murderous, corrupt. Because there's horrible, murderous, corrupt people everywhere. Look at Enron, the CEOs, those corrupt folks. So, you know, everywhere, every group has their corrupt, murderous people. And I, I will know for a fact, knowing a few police officers, that those that commit these horrible acts, the officers that I know, also agree that those folks should have never had a badge, should have never represented the agencies that they got signed up for, and it makes everybody look bad. But I can't condemn a whole group. My only opinion is the ones that are doing these horrible things should be brought to justice. And and then every, every single field should be cleaned up as best as possible. But I can't condemn, I, I know too many officers who are not corrupt. I know too many who all they wanna do is do their jobs and go home to their families I'm actually thrilled that I'm allowed to drive slowly. There's not a lot of traffic today. Normally during a week, even on these streets, these side streets, if you wanna call them that, there's always traffic, there's always through traffic. As we're on the corner of 20th Avenue, or crossing the intersection with 20th Avenue. Crossing 21st Avenue. Lava Designs on the left. on the corner of 22nd Avenue and headed to the very last block on in this episode. All right, guys, this is the very last block. I wanna thank you guys for joining me. Just wanted to show you, this is another iconic spot here the horseless carriage automobile and storage transportation a name that comes to mind is malatesta no Ugh, i don't know if that's the word but that's the uh entrance to route 80 over there ahead we're just gonna 
kind of back up here and get back out here into traffic. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching and joining me on this Featuring Every Streets program. I really appreciate it. I want to thank all the subscribers. We're almost to 2,000 subscribers. We have about 80 more people to go, 80 more subscribers. And again, want to thank you. Please like and subscribe. That really, really helps support the channel. And we'll see you on the next Pride and Patterson Featuring Every Street video.